kia I'm here to carry on the videos that we've been doing about pronouncing the vowels correctly. So today we're looking at E. So we call this letter E in English and it's often pronounced with that sound like the words me and he. But in Te Reo Māori it will always be E. Always. Never ever not E. The only reason it would be E is if it has a macron. So let's practice with the consonants. Here. So this is like the word he in he aha, which means what? He. Then we've got ke, me. So me, not me. And our English speaking brain wants to look at that word and think it says me. But it's needing to change to looking at more, more and more Māori words, saying them out loud, practicing them, and then something clicks in your brain. That's what happened to me anyway. And you know that it's a Māori word, so it must be me. Ne, pe, re, te, we. That's another one that your brain will think it's an English word because it looks like the word we. We. Ne. Fe. So most of these aren't words in themselves. Some of them are, like he, me. Um, so they're part of words that we know, but individual words perhaps just he and me. But mainly, because we're putting a break after every vowel, I want you to practice just having one syllable first. So this is one syllable. He, ke, me, ne, pe, re, te, we, ne, fe. That's all there is to it. We'll do the next letter next time. Kakite.